welcome to Take 5's Gone Batty playlist. I'm going to try to create a cute little bat with a paint pour. I'm using my funnel, fluted funnel, with colors that remind me of this time of year and trick or treat. And I tried to kind of shape up just one wing on this canvas. Screwed up a little bit right here because it ended up looking more like a spider web. And so then I'm trying to shape it up a little bit more with my palette knife to make it look like a, a bat. So guys, this is a playlist for Take 5 and your host today, or myself, Jeannie's Palette, Mary from The Painted Peach, and Christy from Funky Junk Inspiration. And our collaborators are Nicole Pro Sparkle Junkie, Marlene from Mar Marley Grace Creations, Corey from Creative Roots Art, and Jeannie from Clifton's Crafty Casa. And they are all going batty today. So here we are. I have shaped it up, trying to make it look like one wing, but I decided that really did not look good to me. So I'm going to come back thought those little points at the bottom might resemble little feet so I have a bamboo skewer and I am just drawing out in this paint what I think a little bat would look like so I did his little body now I'm working on his head and here I'm working on his ears it's going to be really cute in the end but this was a struggle um, so I did one canvas wiped it off completely and then started over with this one all right now i'm trying to decide exactly where i think the top of the wings should end up before i scrape paint off and then i decide well let me just take it off the top here around his head where i know it's coming off and then revisit how it looks and decide from there so i'm just wiping the paint off I can't remember. I think I do go back and add a little bit of black in because this did drag down to the canvas quite a bit there just to get rid of that color. Ends up looking kind of gray with the white and the black and all the other colors mixed together. So here our little bat is coming together. We're getting there. I kind of thought I would leave that little fancy thing on the top of the ear but I couldn't quite get it to match on the other side. So I do end up doing away with that. We're just working her out, getting our shape. It's going to be adorable with all these colors. Not traditionally what I would do in a painting, but I think it turned out fantastic. And you will see that here shortly. In my description is the link to the playlist so you can see everybody else and all the things they do. We do not have any other paint pour artists in our group. But we have some great other creatives. We all do something different. So here I am again trying to decide where I think the top of that wing should be. And now I'm scraping the paint away to give us a bat. So let's get rid of all of that with my palette knife. I'm using a small pointy one. I think it's the number one palette knife. When I get on the other side, I did try to fancy up that ear a little bit, but there he is. I think he's adorable. I hope you guys will like and subscribe to my channel if you saw something you like. And thanks so much for watching. Ta-ta for now.